I'm Brian, and you're watching 30 Miles Out. You're watching 30 Miles Out Kayak Fishing TV. 30 Miles Out is presented by McCain High Performance Graphite Rods. Make every cast count. everybody it's uh, five o'clock it's pitch black final day of the camp out it's Sunday and it's raining we're gonna do uh, the flats again this morning I'd like to thank everybody who came out good morning America what's going on man you way up in the stratosphere that's the way we roll up here <laughs> that's why you do it in North Carolina yes sir you ready to roll Paul that old <laughs> that old rudder just just a dragon Pescador, I was wondering what kind of boat you had. Yeah, it's a lot of pedaling. <laughs> That's the most minimal drive of the non-mirage drives they make. Yeah. Oh, lightning! Well, we got a little crew here this morning. We're gonna fish the flats. Where's everybody from? Us? Asheville, Nate. North Carolina. David Brown. Flint. Yeah, Brown, so he's right over there. Across the street. Yeah. <laughs> Jamie Gillen, Memphis, Tennessee. <laughs> Adam Alderman, Station out of Moody, Georgia. Dennis Bowen, Memphis, Tennessee. We're letting the rain pass. Then we're gonna head out and chunk some top water or something. Follow Brian today because he knows where all the big trout are. Over there. I, I, as soon as I started catching ladyfish. All right. All right. Let's see what they got on the flat this morning. Brian got a trout. That's a you go. That's a good start. Fish off. <laughs> Does everybody know how to walk the dog? If anybody's curious on how to walk the dog, feel free to come over. Yeah, there was something chasing bait. Yeah, knocking it out of the water. Look at that. Enough ruckus, man. What'd you get? What'd you get him on? Uh, Top water. Top water. Yeah. Like a Zara's Peak Top Tip. Yeah. And he's gone. Good. <laughs> Catch or release, baby. I think so. Yeah. Man, that was a violent strike. He's turning my boat. Spin me in circles. Come on now. Get out the boat, man. All up in my business. Oh, that's a school or something. You got it, Ty? Is he tangled on you? Yeah. Come on over to help you. School of. That's fun. The big ladyfish were super thick this morning. That's awesome. I love them things. Anything that'll hit top water that aggressively, I love. You pulling it from them? Are you hooked up? You got them? I know. Lady fish extravaganza. We don't have snook. It better not be a snook. You got a snook, you're going in the newspaper. <laughs> I 
these darn things are hilarious. Really swirling at the boat. Lady fish don't care. They'll hit anything. Except get a double. Got one coming after. Oh yeah. About to annihilate. Oh, you got it. Coming in hot. <laughs> Hook my line, man. That's all right. Oh, that's your. This is off. Yep. All right. It's on. I don't think it's a skipjack. I don't think it's a lady food. Ooh, that's a nice trout. That's a nice trout. Yes, sir. And they're popping shrimp over here. Yes, sir. That's what I'm talking about. Trout bite on this particular grass flat has been super consistent this summer. This sucker go 18 inches. Luke Jr. Boy, he got a big old fat gut on him too, man. Blowing up on bait and I threw over there and wow. Another nice trout. Woo! Good lord. Oh, yeah, that's a nice one. Yes, sir. That's a nice trout. All right. The last one was 18. Yeah, this one's on this 18 and a half, right? The trout are thick right here, man. That's awesome. Let's see what you got. Oh, yeah. You want to see if he keeps? You got that's, a ruler? That's a keeper, yeah. Is he? Yeah. You only got to be 15. Bass Pro Shop model. There you go. A dinner tonight at the campground. There you go. That's good eating too, man. I heard that. Nice. That's a good looking trout. This is a perfect example of match the hatch. When it comes to top waters, the cadence and the size is what really matters, not so much the color. Mr. Brown's top water plug here was a quarter inch smaller than everybody else's, and he was out catching us all. Two to one. They're liking the profile of that little top water. Sometimes the bass stuff will work, so. That's all we're using. Just on the flats is bass gear. Walking the dog is a bass technique. Ryan's got something big. Huh? I like the jack. Oh man, that's a big Spanish dude. Huh? That's a nice size Spanish. Look at that. All right, that's a big one, man. <laughs> Bigger we were catching offshore. Bite my foot. Yeah, that is a nice Spanish, man. Looks like the ones that hit the cigars. Yeah. That's a big dude. Big old Spanish. On top water. Yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> Great bite. I love it. <laughs> Spanish mackerel in the sound. Uh oh, I got Palm Beach Pete's little Missouri on, and I've been whacking them every cast. The top water bite wore off, so we oh, scaled it down to small suspension baits. Small was the key. Whoever had the smallest top water was catching the fish, whoever had the smallest suspension bait was catching the fish.
Seventeen answer. Don't be gone. Y'all gonna have plenty to eat tonight. Yeah. Did he hit it, Brian? It. All right. There you go. Had to scale it down. Eleven. Uh, usually about now they let the jet skis loose, and you can see them pulling out. Once once they start doing donuts around you, it's over with. <laughs> yeah, they're gearing up over there. They're about to start going. Y'all made it out. Y'all been out here all morning? Y'all doing any good? Top water? Nice. Did he get it in? Yeah. Oh, good, man. Oh, you saw me? Yeah. Thank y'all for coming out. Hey, not a problem. I enjoyed it. Thank you for having us. Uh huh. Pliers and stuff. Those big old corks. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, sh that's a shark. Don't spell me. I'm trying to catch jacks. Trying to catch trout. I'm going to Brian's house. I'll see y'all later. Okay, folks, this is a massive fish. I'm not pedaling yet. This is a sleigh ride. I'm about to have to start pedaling because if I don't, he's going to spool me. I could use a little help. Fighting a big fish, running a camera, taking pictures, doing social media. It's a lot of work when you got a fish this big. Ty, if he's going that way, man, I could use a ride to the airport. <laughs> what do you think, man? Think it's a think it's a ladyfish? <laughs> That's what I love about Florida. Going to big trout one minute. Next minute you get hammered by monster jack. <laughs> Pensacola sleigh ride. Oh, I'm not going to help you. I'm just going to film it. <laughs> coming at you, coming at you. What are you using, Ty? Came top waters and broken backs, Abu Pro Max, 15 pound spider wire, and a Spook Junior. Yeah, it's a brute. It's a big one, guys. Holy smokes. Fish gripping the lip. <laughs> Talk about wearing out, bro. Oh my gosh. This is one of the biggest jacks I've ever caught. And it was caught, yes, on top water. You can see the Spook Junior in his mouth, bone white. What an epic morning. What an epic 30 mile out camp out. What? Somehow my live crab Oh, all right. Let's just take a picture. What a fish. I was so pumped. I was absolutely worn out from chasing this brute. He almost spooled me like three or four times. He'd take on my line, I'd have to regain it by sprinting. All right, I'm going to try to get some air going through this brute. I'm 
good. Teresa wears me out. I'm in shape. All right, we're gonna let her go. What an amazing morning, and I'm glad it happened during the 30 mile out camp out. Too bad Teresa slept in. Right, Teresa? Yeah. <laughs> she wasn't feeling good. She stayed in the tent. But I'm glad I went out there, and I'm glad I had my top water. Woo! What about them? Out here, Pensacola. Just past all the tourists and the jet skis. There's some big fish lurking out here, people. You got a good excuse. <laughs> what a great group of people. You know, we've just had a lot of fun out here at the uh, 30 Mo camp out. This is me and Teresa's backyard, and it's been a real pleasure to show people how to fish what we fish all the time, you know? So, uh, hey, thanks a lot for watching, and we might get to fish with you one day. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time right here on 30 Miles Out. What? Word on the street, you caught a bull red. Heard that? Heard it from the water. Yeah, it was right near that little sign right there. There, the trout were hitting on top water, and I was throwing that thing. It seemed like the uh, seemed like the trout hit it harder when I really was popping it hard, you know. Yeah, started popping it hard, nice and slow, and that thing came up and just I saw him come up and eat it about 10 feet from the boat. Nice. I was yelling at all them. But, you, the but you're glad you had your heavier stuff at that point. Yeah. <laughs> I was freaking out. <laughs> you know, that's what's good about this flat is it's is it drops off, mm -hmm. so the big stuff can come up on it and then go back down deep. Yeah, she almost time. quit. I was like, yeah. take it. This ended up being so much fun. So many good people. Mm -hmm. I had a great time. Everybody was awesome. Uh, a lot of fish were caught. They came from far and wide. They did. I was I was really surprised. Paul came from Ohio. I know, long drive. There was Texas, Ohio, North Carolina, South Carolina. Um, Memphis? Yeah, Dominic came from Houston. His dad flew yeah. in from Colorado. Crazy cool. We got to do it again. Thanks. Absolutely. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. We'll see y'all.